That's why I try to keep like the mic toward you. Well, also, I tend to be quieter on the mic, even though I'm closer. I'm always too goddamn quiet in I, everything. Sometimes I don't eat. I'll, I'll go like 20 minutes without talking while streaming, and then I feel super bad because I'm like, no. I've seen how real streamers do no, it. No, what I mean is I, whenever I speak. Oh, I thought, you, okay, never mind. Two entirely different talks. Right, so on Discord, everyone says that I'm too quiet. On Twitch, they frequently say my voice isn't loud enough compared to the game audio. I must have kept the lid and on it this time. I've used different headsets. I think you're more soft-spoken. <laughs> ignore that, ignore that sound. It was Pez, it was Pez. I should, um... I guess if I made a tactics character based on me, I'd need to have McDarlov on. McDarlov. That's the AoE sleep. Ah. Uh, so we're about to drop our seventh album. Maidens of Blackwater. Yeah! Woo! On. So, funny thing. Nothing about this game. Actually, yes. Oh, go ahead. Um, almost every North American release of this game mm -hmm. um, removed some of the unlockable outfits. God damn it! Yeah. Um, most of them were swimsuits. They kept some, though, or at least added different ones. And I, guess I would the actually. More revealing ones were removed. Um. Given that this game involves wanting to try to avoid getting wet, adding swimsuits is really more of a comical addition than a just plain sexy one. Wouldn't it be great if there was a wetsuit, and if you had that costume on, your taint would stay dry the whole time? Yes. But it never tells you that. It's just, this is a great outfit for staying dry. <laughs> and that's it. That's the description. That's gone. It's done. Yeah. Oh, the outfits don't even have descriptions. No. Yeah? No, they don't. So They don't, so... You could just say, like... Wetsuit. Mm-hmm. And there would be another one called the really wetsuit. And it's just like, it's your clothes, but they always look like they're wet, like when they're rained on. Yes. And you have max taint all the time. Not to the point you're losing health, but... Where you could... You only, you only lose health from ghost attacks that cause that. Hmm. Um, just getting wetter will not cause you to lose health. But it'll just raise, fill the gauge up. Yes. Now, I did look up exactly what being at max wetness does. Mm -hmm. It lowers your defense and raises the encounter rate. Oh, shit. Yeah. Ah, that's two debuffs. I don't like that. I thought we bought these two. I guess I didn't save the game. But that's still no, my favorite you, outfit. You did buy it. No, nope, it's not blue. Oh. Or did I? Okay. Yeah, see, I, okay, like, okay, yeah. I did buy these. Mm -hmm. I didn't buy them that are in blue. So it's black underneath that. That's cute. Whoop. Don't zoom in. Kitsy guy. Everyone has such nice hair in this game. They do. It's almost as good as mine. Almost. Almost. Careful with that thing on. The ghost might choke her. <laughs> I think the maid's hairband would look good with this. But I'm at that point where like, I want to upgrade my shit because I'm starting to run out of ammo. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna keep. Oh, it gives her makeup too. Yeah, a little bit. It gives her a little bit. Sure. No, I've just been informed that someone is watching. Hello, Ishul. We're just screwing around with character creator for a second. Character creator. Costumes. Costume chooser. Costume chooser. So, uh, Ishul, this is the punk ensemble. It's currently our favorite. Here's the cutesy goth. Um... It's not as elaborate as some of the goth Lolita outfits I've seen people have, but it's, it's not bad. Honestly, if it was much more elaborate than this, it would 
it would just be too much for what she does. Yeah. It's very leggy. This looks like an outfit made by, like, Clamp. Well... Oh. Here's Tokyo Godfathers. Put it in your fucking bag. All oh. these years I've tried to get you to watch it. And you're, nah, I don't, I don't know. No, I'm not even really interested. As soon as I say it's Satoshi Kon. Satoshi Kon? But why didn't you use that argument before? Because I didn't know you were aware of who the fuck he was! <laughs> not enough petticoat on the goth. Okay. <laughs> All right, Wishful, I get it. We'll, we'll stick with Punk Ensemble. I haven't found any hair. I wish it would, like, unlock by, by chapter... But it looks like we'll have to do things to unlock these outfits. I've also heard that um, the music that plays during the ending credits will change if you have the In This Cage re-equipped. Oh, really? Hell yeah, I've got it equipped. I guess that's the song. There must be a J-pop song called In This Cage. In J-pop. Yeah, of course I do. It's the same outfit I had on. Seventh draw. We are a third of the way through this game. I wonder if it's counting uh, f uh, actual play percent, or if it's like those uh, chapter entries at the beginning. Mm. Like they each are worth ten, even though some of them are not really gameplay; they're just like run around the house. It's been an uneven progression. Okay, so yeah, it's probably gameplay length of. What is phrase one of the scores will not be recorded. Ah. You're not that much. No, I'm not, because I want my fucking scores recorded, because I've been doing really good. Yes. And I'm worried if I do that, it'll be like, oh, you don't unlock any of the outfits. I was like, go fuck yourself. Yuri finds Miyu in the Shrine of the Ephemeral, but not Ahsoka. Oh, right, she was looking for Ahsoka. Seems like she forgot that. Oh, fuck, she was, was it? <laughs> Shit! The Yuri... girl we rescued and then ran away with the ghost again. Yeah. Yuri's final hope is to follow the river upstream from where she found the camera obscura to its source. The Lake of the Departed. Meanwhile, her teacher's out there like, I'm fucking dying up here! Wait, no, I forgot. Hisoka is her teacher. Um, had, they just forgot about the girl who they were going to take care of, but left in the middle of the night because she got repossessed. Repossessed? <laughs> That's an old movie. Okay, I guess we're going to start out. Uh, I am going to buy... Not that! God, it's like one at a time. Shit. Let me just type. You know what we're gonna go in with this? Yeah. We've been doing the basic setup. Can I have less? No. To get more points back? Because no. I'd get rid of that fucking mirror stone in a heartbeat. No, I wouldn't. We It'll cash in at the. the we cash it in at the end of the chapter. Let's stop the show. Made in the black water. Yuri Kozakata. Yuri Kozakata. Yuri Kozakata. Yuri managed to rescue Mew from the shrine of the ephemeral, but obtained no new information about Hisoka. The only clue she has are a photograph found in the Kamwa Obscura and the vision she saw when she touched Hisoka's charm. These led Yuri to believe Hisoka is somewhere upstream. Clinging to this last hope of finding her friend, Yui heads towards the Lake of Departed, located on Mount Hakami's summit. If you could see my face now, chat. I can't see your face right now! Because of the way the light's hitting the back of your head and not the front. Uh, I am... Twiles of Mana. Twiles. <laughs> I found Mew, but I've made no progress with finding Hisoka. Oh, that's right, my teacher's missing. My boss, mentor, and adoptive mother is fucking gone. And she's the person you've been looking for the longest. This is all I have to go on. This photo and the vision I saw when I touched Ahsoka's charm. It's cute. I think I'll keep it. She was standing in water. There's a lake on the summit of Mahakam. It's called Lake of the Departed. Ahsoka might be there. <laughs> mm. You know what else might be there? Death. Why don't you call up Rin and go together? Yeah. Take both your cameras. God, how the... What and, would happen if we took both our cameras? And watch each other's asses. I'd rather watch her ass. Man's got a cute butt, too. Give that. Let me lean back and then, like... She, like, steps five feet back and just, like, leans. <laughs> mm. Do you think she's afraid of getting other parts of her body grabbed? Who's afraid and of And only wants to expose one arm at a time? 
Eh, yeah, maybe. It's closed and the power's been turned off. The poster isn't put up explaining that service has been stopped. If you come all the way up here, look at this and think to yourself, huh, wonder why the train's not running anymore. Oh, wait, never mind. The train is running. You, you got issues. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> and that, the train's how we got here. Ooh, it's raining. Oh, fuck, it is. Ah, it, it wouldn't do any good to, like, clean my taint. No, it's just gonna get wet again. Yeah. Once we get inside, I should probably... I might need to... Ah, fuck it, we've gone this far. And I can just start the chapter over if my score gets too low. Hard reset! I must have a perfect score. Path of the Ephemeral. So is this the Ephemeral Artery? Very funny. You mean the one that doesn't exist? Yes, that one. Well, ephemeral means it's there part of the time. But, um... Damn it, I'm going to teacher mode again. What he's referring to is the femoral artery. An artery that runs... femur. All around the femur. Yep, it's the inside, uh... upper inside leg. And if it gets, uh, cut or stabbed, you got about, what, ten seconds before you bleed out to death? Of course, it's not the old. Well, most arteries, if they're cut, you're fucked. It's because of the high pressure of the. I'm giving away nature checks, damn it! Alright, we'll stop that shit. There's an item up there, I want it. But since I'm midway through this revelation, I'll, I'll give. It's a freebie, folks. I tricked him. Alright. It's because of the high pressure in arterial blood that there's a, a release. For the pressure, the wound, and uh, it's just gonna come gushing out. You've seen animes where people die? Yeah, like that shit. You don't get that from a vein cut in a vein. I saw something that says check. I did too, but. And it was within nature, so. <laughs> Rope has been strung between two large cedars. Okay. Duly noted. Now, what do we do about it? Well, thank you for switching back to Type 7 for that. I'm learning. Also, the game was pretty nice to hand you an extra pack of Type 14 right off the bat. Yeah, type 90, too. Did you see that? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, do I have enough for... Ooh, I do! For range. Eh, it would be nice to hit them before they got to me, but I'm also really close to... You also frequently fight them indoors. Loading... Loading speed has been what's really screwing me over a lot here lately, so I'll probably save up for that. Alright. I forgot we maxed out fucking... It's done. Is it? It's done. It doesn't even say. I cannot it, be upgraded further, but it doesn't tell you what it is. I know it was stunned, though. Yeah. Crush lens, restore lens... I don't care about the slow lens. It's the slow lens. Sorry, I need you to please back the hell up. I like having that stun charge ready. Yes. Because, like, if I get ambushed, I can knock him away and give myself some breathing room. And it looks like, yep, you've got enough for one more stun if needed. God, it was so good upgrading that. Got it! Ha <laughs> ha! Hurts, don't it? Did I get him? Or is he faking it? Nope. 
Back up. Thank you, Dad. You're not alone. Idiots, you absolute fools. They decided to just like team um, up on each other. They, 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 speaking of team, are they healing each other? Stop that! I forbid it! care of everybody yeah. he oh. was he was fucking healing him did you see the health go up no like but that's been... what it fucking looked like they might have been charging something else but was that three red robe guys total I think it was like one and then like two more yeah it seemed like they were kind of weaker than that first one I encountered yeah The Forbidden Valley. It's where they make the ranch. <laughs> Sorry. Forbidden Valley salad dressing. So a couple things I don't like is that the game won't let you backtrack or sidetrack. And I'm not... And I really don't like when it's like, oh, uh, I think they don't tell you when you've hit a point where you can't back up. Right. Because, like, I want to know if, like... It, it looks like we only screwed up once, and that was during the um, the, the trip on the road. You know, I really wanted to do more exploring. I think that was the last chapter, wasn't it? Yes. The light adjusted as I got closer. I thought for sure that something was coming after me. So grab a hands. Grab a touch of damage. Yep, we're gonna have a fight. Well, this looks suspicious as hell. Nah, it's fine. Turns out it was. But then he's going to attack you now. Or maybe not. Work those glutes. Yep, she's gonna have some uh, Amazon legs after this. I don't think I can get through here. There must be a way. Look, I'm not in the best shape, but I could climb over that. But in this skirt? Fair enough. I've never tried to climb anything in this skirt before. You know what she's ripped stockings cost her? About 10,000 camera points? <laughs> How much is that in real money? Uh, I'm coming for you! Back up. Creepy dude. Oh crap, it's Boxy Brown again. Boxy Brown! Here there was a boxing match. Damn. That's like a full fucking combo. Damn, I'm knocking him the fuck out, ain't I? Mm -hmm. Oh, you may have gotten him.
Well, that looks like the right way, so we're going to check over here. You are, you are doing really well so far. I kind of wish we could string the other Fatal Frames. You know, remind me sometime, and I can get my PS2 down here, and we'll see if it'll... if we can hook it up oh, to the that, stuff. That's the right way. Alright, let's go back to where Boxy Brown was. Uh, sorry, Boxy, we're coming back for you, baby. Boxy, baby. Fucking shadow on the grass. Every time the fucking flashlight moves and, like, casts shadows, it scares the shit out of me. I know that's the probably the point. Most likely. Uh, oh, red flowers. How pretty. Uh, we probably got to do something, or later the plants will be gone. So we're just not supposed to go here yet. I guess not. Okay. I mean, there's places like that in Resident Evil. You don't have a key, or it's blocked off. Yeah. This water. Now, interesting fun fact: uh, uh, Japanese they do not bury their dead. These are just tombstones. Mm -hmm. There's no corpses buried beneath them. I believe that it's it's all uh, cremation. Oh. oh, I we can double check to be sure, but I also read that the shots you make during a fatal frame don't reduce your film. Ooh. Which makes the Type Zero more useful if that's true. Is it Bubbles again? It's the Tall Woman. Oh, oh damn. Oh shit. Uh, hey cutie, I'm gonna need you to, to back up a little. I'm bit. gonna switch to Top Six to One because you scare the the jonkers out of me. So, um, I did look up the Tall Woman ghost. And she has no connection to the curse. Or anything going on in this mountain. She's a traveling spirit that took an interest in what's going on here. And wants you dead. That's awful. Does she like she like an optional boss? I'm not sure if that's the right term for her. Bonus enemy? Sure, if that works. Got her. Hey. You're really cute. Certainly takes her time going. I wonder if this is the first time you can fight her. She's not connected at all, she's just like a local legend. I'm not even sure she's local. Oh, I guess this looped around. Whoa! I'm gonna need you to take a step back, sir. You gotta take enough shots to get that combo up, because every time you hit them, it adds another. See? Mm -hmm. So if I get a few hits in, I can do that. Five shots. Well, he, this one's on the weak side. Oh, that's so 
cool. We fought the tall lady. Mm -hmm. And she's not relevant to the story at all. No? She's just a bonus. She's a treat. Okay, I think we came this way earlier. That's how we got to it the first time. So, we'll just, we'll just, I guess we just go back. So I guess if Bomb was here, we'd have to tell him we fought Mommy Milkers. Yep. So I did notice that uh, in a couple of spots your dampness did go down. It looks like that um, you're not stuck at this state. When like once I'm somewhere when it's wet, I start drying off? Yes, it looks like once you're full, you're not stuck with a wet taint. Huh. Okay. Oh boy! got a lot of them. They don't seem to be as bad as Fatal Frame 2's monks, thankfully. Those guys were... They were bad. I saw an item behind you, I think. Yeah, it's on the other side. Oh, okay. I tried to reach it earlier. Stun recharges so fast now, I can use it so freely. It's not depleting. I was watching your ammo. <laughs> okay, that makes... Once again, Fatal Frames seem to be the most efficient way to fight. I just gave him like a five hit combo. Okay, that's clearly where I'm supposed to. And your combo broke him. Yes. You look special, but you're not. I'm probably gonna have to come find this fucking monk here in a minute and be like, oh, to reveal the path. Yeah. Take pictures. don't have to come back and find those cages of monks, I'm going to be legitimately surprised. His staff is his weak point. Yes.
I had a death whale. Ah! A death whale. <laughs> Off the merchandise. I am my clean water. How the hell? Oh shit. I gotta go around to get that. Fuck. Would you stop? A lot of people complained about the controls. Maybe they'll do update fix. Maybe. Not likely. Oh, you think this game just kinda got. Just release on PS4 and we're done with it. Yeah. As uh, a lot of crap that was... A lot of things that were in an updated re-release on the Wii U are not in this port. Like those cut costumes. It's not there. Sorry, backtracking, but I, I might need that ammo. Yes. Type 61, that's shotgun ammo. Mm -hmm. Alright, now we'll back to I can still kind of hear like the monk music. That for world. This might be a different track that's meant to invoke that theme. Let you know there are a lot of monks in the area. I, it might also be something that plays when I'm at full taint. Not sure about that. Running may alert the ghost. Ooh, files. Ahsoka's journal. It's very pretty. I like it. Really nice looking notebook. I'm sure she came this way after all. Leather bound? Little belt? Go ahead. Beyond the Forbidden Valley is the sacred ground at the summit, the Twilight Peak, and the Lake of the Departed. If she has the ability, it's possible she was led there. Or perhaps I'm the one who's being called to that place. Very good. Where's Toll Lady? Sweetie, baby, where are you? You really want to fight her again so soon? Say anything about fighting. You see, your dampness has gone down a little bit. Because I'm like, technically, I'm under that. Yes. But then I'll step out here and it's back up. It the rain might stop in the next area. The twi the twilight peak, where we all might sparkle in the afterlife. Oh, I was gonna make a twilight princess reference. Yeah, twilight. Oh. I thought you were making a Twilight vampire movie. Thing. No, 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 no. And then, um... I thought you'd also be happy at the prospect of seeing Midna. Yeah, it's going down very slowly. Yeah, it's not raining. I'm slowly drying off. This place looks fucking desolate. I think the debuff only applies when it's at full. Damn, I was trying to get all three of them. Because of the reload, it wouldn't have... I wouldn't have been able to get them in all three anyway. You got one. That's better than nothing. Uh, Alright, let's go this way. So, we're trying a naturally drying tank? Oh, yes. I like sound based being... Daka, daka. I'm reminded of the pinwheels from Sekiro. Didn't they symbolize, like, the safe place or something? No. Oh. They were connected to the uh, temple where monks were performing rather twisted experiments on children. Hmm. That's kind of creepy. You can see the white yeah. glowy shadow. What would that be? The, the anti-shadow? Yay, it's a box! I've had so much luck opening these! 
Okay, so there's a there's a bong. All right, there's some dildos. At least they kept that one upright. There's a. Is that a little like red chef's hat? I doubt it's keeping track of like all the photos I'm taking. <laughs> yes, wait a what? Ha ha! Evasion! is so awful taken out of context <laughs> what the it. five fingers say to the face snap <laughs> sorry <laughs> I like I, it I had to cry really stupid no it was great you know if reload speed gets a massive upgrade it might be practical to build up the circles on Type 7 and then switch to something more powerful for the combo finisher. I was actually thinking that earlier. Type right. 7 ain't exactly weak. No, especially not after you got that power upgrade. that always bother me about ghost kids playing hide and seek they just can't keep their mouths shut as well as living kids not really as good at hiding the rear shrine huh you do like the crazy old man voice for this one well it looks similar to that style so yeah the lost orphan children are called by the sunset to climb called by the sun as it sets in the realm of the dead crossing over to the netherworld so that they might cross over into the netherworld as they come together and play we honor them with effigies that's the worst haiku I've ever read yeah it's supposed to be 757 where's the 575 I think it's 575 I got another rocket and the music went quiet Maybe because I played with the children, they gave me... Oh, no, here we go. The dolls are missing from the middle of the room. Someone must have taken them. The camera is reacting. I thought it said reaching for something. You heard rotate? Nope, oh, there we go. Hee hee. Hee hee. Well... So one of them's right above me. Alright. I have to back up a little bit. No, do I have to fight him now? That's kind of how it worked in the other ones. Huh. 
I guess we accidentally went where we were supposed to go. Maybe on the other route we'd be blocked. Yeah. Okay, so we're looking for Red Hat, which is him over here, mm -hmm. and then five in a row, which is further the, back. It's probably down that way because we haven't found. Well, let's yet. take care of Red Hat here. Yeah. I saw you moving back there. And it's a real disappointment that ghost kids suck at hiding so much because they can go through things. It's a real shame, that. Got that one centered. Soka made it pretty damn far. Keep in mind, she couldn't have taken the cable car. But she didn't have her camera. She did have the camera with her, but I forgot. But we don't know exactly when she lost it. Gotcha. Well, you want to keep looking around before we put the dolls back? Mm, sure. Hopefully this wasn't like an optional thing and then we miss out on it. That would suck. But how are you gonna know? Ooh, sulfur springs. Any ghost women wanna come out and show me their bodies? No, of course not. Oh, plenty of ghost women are gonna come out and show you their bodies, just not necessarily here. You see that over there? Yeah, that's my body. <laughs> yeah? That mangled pile of meat? That's me. There's a ghost from the yellow drops. There is. Nearby is hot and filled with essential sulfur. You called it Sulfur Springs. I might be hallucinating. Also, the water is yellow, so. Mm -hmm. Good possibility. I have no idea where I'm going. This looks interesting. Uh. Makes you think of Fatal Frame 3's beach. Where you launch the memorials to the dead. I think I'm gonna get to a fight out here. Run! Run, mm. bitch! There's plenty of room, thankfully. Oh, you are not seriously. Fucking watch me. Fail here. Yep. What's wrong? Ah! Okay. Boo! So if you get knocked down in water, your taint will start to get wet. Really? Yeah. But not if I'm just walking through it. Well, normally, no. Really? Yeah, because it's not going up now. I was going to run for the Tory Gate. T O R I. Did you notice the music was silent when we were on the beach? Yes. Yeah, I didn't notice that until the music came back on. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. The fumes from the sulfur spring. Add to the eeriness here. Should we... Well, if that's where we have to go and it's the only place you left, I'm going to go to the doles. Before it, like, tells me to go there. Although... It let me do this without being told to do it. So maybe it really is something optional and we'll get a nice reward. Mm. Or at least something interesting. Are they going to fight me? Probably. Or maybe this is like how you exercise them. You got the reward, Linz. Oh, Increases we did get a reward. Increases number of points earned by taking photos for a short time. Huh. So you can activate it and then like... You get bonus points. Interesting. Equip it to your camera obscura and press square when you have the spirit out. It's showtime. Guys, can you give me just a second? <laughs> Children, please, hold on. You want to put it over restore? Yeah, because I haven't really been using that. It's also cheap to upgrade. 
effects duration from 10 to 15 seconds, and then maybe 15 to 20. Also, I think you've got enough points you can get that power upgrade or whatever it is you... Oh, almost. Almost. Hmm. Loader or power? Let's do power. We're this fucking close. Yes. And whatever you're about to fight will likely get you there. Oh, come on. Honestly, I was expecting someone a little more imposing to appear after doing that. As I think this is the equivalent of the Man in Dark from the second game. The one that looks kind of like a zombie and is basically the weakest ghost. Man in Dark? Is it because his spirit's like so far gone? I think so. I wouldn't recommend yeah, not getting cornered. Yeah, I, I felt that, and I, I, that's why I stunned them. Excellent. Camera output. Power. Not bad. That's what it needs to be like two hundred thousand or something. Yeah. It only increased the cost by fifty percent. Yeah. Nope. A oh, third. Yes. A third. Twelve to. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you should be putting ghosts down a little quicker now. Now my type 7 is more powerful. That's one way of looking at it. Yes. Oh. Fully at ready. Your type 7 is as strong as your type 14. I'm like, good. That's all I need. <laughs> Handgun ammo only. That would be an interesting playthrough uh, for Resident Evil. Get infinite ammo, but you can only use the pistol. What about games that have multiple handguns? Long as it's handgun. Okay. You can only use pistol. Actually, oh boy, she brought her luggage. I did a run like that in the remake. Aw, she's kind of like a cute old lady. She looks eerily normal for a ghost. What if she isn't a ghost? What if, what if this is her mother? She's not dead. Hmm. So, could you not? I see the mirror. Pay no attention to the lady behind the mirror. <laughs> oh, is that the box she's going to kidnap me in? Is that the box she just fucking kidnapped me in? Hey, hey, I got your bitch! I think she didn't take my camera away. Oh shit, I gotta close it! I have to fight my way out of the fucking box. That was actually pretty cool. Bitch, you're not gonna box us in. You know what? Stunning, isn't it? I was wondering when you'd finally fight one of the uh, mirror people. She's not alone. I think she's... Oh, these orbs! She's teleporting... That's why they're like... About to grab you. Baron has taught me well-ish. I'm well-ish! Now you can pronounce those impossible town names, right? Oh, 
I get rid of some orbs. This bitch is all over the place. charged on my grandma energy. Ah! Got her mid-slide. <laughs> See you cha-cha slide your way out of this. Alright, old lady's got some moves. She looks so happy. Did you see that? Yes. She's like, yay, this is fun. I lured my grandchildren to their, this suicide mountain so they'd actually visit me. <laughs> All right, that gets dark. I'm sorry. No, I like it. <laughs> don't, don't apologize for that. <laughs> Didn't mean for it to go that far. Oh, she came at me with the mirror. Did you see that? Yes. I'm beating her with just type 7. I realize that's what I have equipped right now. I'm afraid if she gets too close with that mirror, I'm fucked. Most of the time, they have a fatal frame opportunity. When they come at you with a mirror? When they come at you... Trying to like follow her with the thing while spamming shutter. Fire seems like a weird word to use. Fighting a mid game mid boss with um Oh shit, she's casting Shadow Ball. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to look at the box. Tee hee hee. Oh shit. I did not like that dark, glowy energy she had on her. <laughs> so make her take a step back. <laughs> you need to back up with that creepy shit, Grandma. Turn with the black feathers when I turn to belong to that old woman. We must forge more pillars. The great pillar is collapsing. The black water will overflow. The black water must be contained before the great pillar melts away. I became a shrine maiden after I survived that flood. I was half dead when I awoke, alone amongst the corpses. I could see things, things that no one else could see. This was my calling. I purified my body, and when I arrived at the mountain, I was overwhelmed with a cacophony of voices. The talking trees, the whispering stones, the weeping water. Echoes of past prayers piled up on one on top of another. Time slowed to a crawl, and I could see each individual raindrop that fell. Man, was I high. <laughs> the veins on every leaf stood out vividly. I shouldn't have ate that mushroom. I am tripping balls. Images of death flashed in front of me. I could smell the choking stench of death. That's when I realized I had left the oven on. It was a gas oven. I was told I would need more training. I wanted to flee as soon as I arrived, but I had no hope. <sighs> Where to? No matter where I go, it'll be the same. In the end, 
I will be alone. You got the blow lens. It doesn't let you allows you deal twice the normal damage output to targets. Ah, uh, yes. In two, you got other damage lenses than just crush. And most of the time, they, they cost more, but they were more powerful. So crush is like, this is for early on. Yes. And it's like, here's a better one. There's also items up here. Yes. I didn't take a single hit in that fight. Nope, you didn't. Holy You've shit. You've been doing really well on healing items this chapter. Holy shit. And then we just jinxed it. Okay, so... I guess we don't need crush when we have blow. <laughs> oh yeah, blow the cameraman, baby. What is it called? <laughs> so it was cheaper! <laughs> Oh, no, no, this does... Okay, this does two times damage. But I can use it more frequently. And Crush does what? Two times damage right away, and then it does 250% damage. Okay, so Crush, Crush can become more pow... I like this balance. Crush is more powerful, but Blow is more frequent. Right. Hmm. So, you want to frequently Blow? Honestly, stun has been helping out more than anything. Yes. Because I use it to uh, knock them, because it still counts as a hit. Mm -hmm. It just flinches them. And then I can use that to keep them away and get more of those spirit orbs to appear. And, you know, the if you're lucky enough to get two ghosts in the same shot, then that buys you a lot of time. Or a ghost in the soul of my friend. <laughs> yes. How does the camera obscure work on normal people? Does it do anything? As far as I know, regular people feel nothing special when they get their picture taken. Hmm. I'm just... I'm just sticking with this. Wait, this one works. Delicious. Oh, now I'm going to use Type 7 to beat her. Yeah. Can you just stand on it? You want to... How many times are we going to go over this lesson, old man? Old woman. <laughs> how many times do I have to teach you this lesson, Grandma? And then she went that way. Yes, thank you. We just saw that. Cool. Heading to the lake. You want to take the other route and see where it goes? It... Or did you... Oh, wait. You came out. You... I came from the lake entrance, and then I saw her, like, taking this route. Oh, okay. Because I came through here? Alright, I... Hold on. Why did I think that arena had a second exit? No, no, it's just... Boom. Done. Okay. Wait, hill... Oh, hill of the departed. I thought it said hill of the deep end. <laughs> I was like, well, that's a weird name for your full party, but okay. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> If I was on the deep end. That's a good song. That's a really good song. If I went off the deep end. Oh, there's an item here. Somewhere. I think. Or something to photograph. What was she doing going that far out into the lake? It's a trap! Yeah, but it's where we have to go. Congratulations, you are now in the fucking netherworld. One place you've been supposed to avoid. See, it's full of sea urchins, too! She's just calmly standing there um, like, fuck Yuri, it, I'm screwed anyway. Yuri. Okay, it's time to move, girl. Oh, this is the invincible one, isn't it? I think it is.
I still think Miku, like, became one of these things. I think that's her. Um, I don't think that's gonna work. Run from the shadow! Maybe she'll get bored? That might be the intention. Speech from before. Have I lost her? I mean, she's just over there, like, on the lawn chair, just, like, sipping a drink. Nope! <laughs> Brushing sand off her. Sorry, I didn't expect you back so quickly. <laughs> Most people never return, and I use this as my break time, and, ah, oh, where was I? <gasps> Let us fall together. I was like, uh, I can't really take you seriously when you're standing there in a thong. Oh! Shit, robe's open. Um. These things are so damn hot in summer, you really can't wear much beneath them. It, you know what's really kills you on the mountain? The fucking humidity. <laughs> Yuri followed Hisoka's trace to the shore of the lake that parted, where it vanished into the mist. In her place, a woman appeared, the same dark presence seen in Hisoka's photograph. Unable to inflict any damage with the camera obscura, Yuri's only option was to RUN! RUN AWAY! Yuri recalled the outline of a large Tory gate over the- It was more than a fucking outline, I can tell you the color of that damn thing. <laughs> over the misty lake, could that be where Hisoka was headed? That was a pretty short chip. Oh shit! Oh shit, bitches! Just rolled me up an S rank! You you that's, kicked That's you, higher than A. You really kicked some S there. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, it's based on uh okay, it's based on your clear time, mm -hmm. your difficulty, points earned from combat, yeah. and points for items. So the less items you use, the higher your fucking rank. And you didn't use a single healing item for one thing. Oh no, I didn't. And look how many, like, type 61, 90, and zeros. Like, look how much that fucking added up. Yes. Damn. Damn! Hell yeah! Well, looks like you're getting pretty Hell good yeah. at this series. Yeah, a little bit. Maiden of Blackwater! Did I unlock any costume? Yeah. That looks like the next, uh, is Rin. I don't like the Grimm's outfit. Alright. I'm taking it off, but... This is, this is a cool outfit. This is, like, something I would wear. Mm-hmm. Looks like me if I was in better shape. His pants look like uh, the default outfit from Bloodborne. Oh god, he looks like me in middle school. Honestly, he does. Holy fuck! Yeah, I'm, I see the photo over there. Yeah! Thin mustache, thin goatee, black glasses, short black hair. God damn, that's a dead ringer for me in middle school. <laughs> Sleepless eyes? Yeah, there it is! So, um, just wait for the time when I call you about marrying a ghost. <laughs> I'm kidding, no ghost in one we have. <laughs> Look, I got 50 bazillion dead men I could choose. You think I'm gonna go for one with a pulse? I can see with a zombie girlfriend. They mm. want you for your brains. Ha, ha, ha. Ba da 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 da. Okay, so next is I could read the whole show. Keep watch. I don't like that at all. Oh, are we gonna have a siege incident? Oh shit, is it? Okay, it's like find, find, find a token, find, find. This one's just keep watch. <laughs> we got to Five Nights at Freddy's this shit. <laughs> oh, what? Wait Come a minute. Back. He's got like five camera obscures hooked up to security cameras. That camera angle in the background. It looks like the antiques. Door, doesn't it? No. <laughs> no, 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 no. I do not like this. I do not. This is bad. You and you 
Yuri's sleep after returning from Mount Hikami. Learning that Haruka has been taken by ghosts, Ren and Ryu keep a watchful eye on the girls to prevent it from happening again. And we know that when shit hits the fan, Rui is dead weight, if not worse. <laughs> Maybe Rui will like, hey, while you're sleeping, I'm gonna borrow your fucking camera, okay? You get some sleep, I'm taking the fucking weapon. <laughs> We don't need this shit. I mean, we're just watching people, right? <laughs> I do like that. I, I just, I already have 73,000 points. Yeah. That's like two thirds of the way to like the next uh, power upgrade. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, I kind of like that. She's not bad. The witching hour. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> mm. I can't tell if that's a ghost we've seen before. It is. It's the office lady. Oh. Yeah, the business suit woman with, like, the cleavage. Like, every other fucking ghost in this game. Except for, except for Granny Warbuck. She was, she was fine. <laughs> oh, now I know why she looked so happy when she did the grab move at you. I'm the only woman on this mountain without spinal issues. <laughs> <laughs> Look how spry I am! Woo! <laughs> Returns from Mount Akami's summit, she quickly collapses from exhaustion. Been there! <laughs> Meanwhile, <laughs> is also in an unnaturally deep slumber. Yeah, when you are sleep deprived and your body just says, hey, guess what? We're shutting down. No heads up or warning. You're out. You're fucking out. <laughs> There have been times where Wishful will like be in there in bed next to me and she's like, do you want to take a nap? I'm like, sure. And I am just blackout collapse like, as soon as I say that word. <laughs> and she's like, you, you wait? Oh, that was quick. You say yes and the guy at the controls in your head says, all right, we've been given permission. <laughs> all right, manual override. <laughs> it's like, why do you do the cold boot? The warm boot will work. Cold boot's faster. <laughs> Worried that some unwanted visitors may be on their way. Okay, so like what you said, they're starting to follow us back. Yes. Rin and his assassin, his assistant, his assassin, Rui, decide to watch over the girls through the shop surveillance system. Oh, sure. Rui could be trained as a professional assassin, but that's not going to help against ghosts. What if she is? That's why she, she's a bodyguard. <laughs> the assistant thing is a cover. She's actually like a fucking trained ninja. Oh, I just look like a young girl. That's just, like, how I grew up, and so, you know, thank God for genetics, because no one suspects me to have a fucking knife. And now Ren's like, God, what am I paying you for again? It's like, shut up, I know, I don't know how to fight ghosts. <laughs> I, I've got no fucking clue. He's looking through the survey. We are doing Five Nights at Freddy's. One thing this game hasn't addressed is... If you take a picture of a security camera, does it affect the ghost? Also... Yeah, because we saw surveillance cameras all over the house. <laughs> did he... Do you have... Did he make any modifications? Or can surveillance cameras... Pick up ghosts? Ruby is really cute, though. Boy or girl, I don't care. Which makes me think something bad's gonna happen to her. Please stop. Don't, don't do this. You literally took your eyes off of it. So, here's something I recommend, Ren. When your eyes are off it, have Rui's on it. <laughs> um, why, why are we not going upstairs? Look. They're out cold. She has no spiritual power. There's a presence. Like a miasma. Or maybe not, but like spiritual pressure, yeah. I guess, if you want to use a bleach term. So, a trend I've noticed in this series, those who have weaker spiritual power are also harder for the ghost to influence. Just asleep. Don't ramp unless something must be happening on the mountain. I should go to the mountain! No! No, Ren. No. no. Ren, look at me. <laughs> Stop that. 
Fucking hell! God <laughs> damn! Fucking stainless steel rings. A pop a knuckle right on that one. Oh damn! That's so fucking painful. <laughs> I could have just clapped my hands and had the same effect. Oh god! I'm not joking. That feels bruised. I see how thick that damn ring is. Have you considered taking the rings off when we stream, just in case? No. Have you think? Have you thought about it now? <laughs> you mean the third time this has fucking happened? Yes. They say third time is the charm. Mm. Fucking hell! All right. No, bad win. <laughs> bad. Oh, that red book probably has a recipe from Dragon Quest Eleven. I guess we're not watching the... Okay, cool. Was led away by the ghost of a dog. I thought he might have come again. Because your pain's came to see if the girls are okay. And Yuri and you are okay. We'll switch between cameras automatically. I thought I saw something move in that last one. And it shows me up there. I think that means there's a ghost here because it's like staticky now. You think it's time to get up? Ren, that's not a bad idea, but now's not the time. I'm betting the the one written in super big print and bolded is do not go to Mount Hikami. Mikamori, in the area around Mount Hikami, there is a custom of receiving water from the mountain. The people call it Mikamori, and it is placed on casts to bring into their homes, used only for special ceremonies. It is used to give a newborn its first bath or to cleanse the bodies of the dead. Wow, really opposite ends of the spectrum there. Yeah. This stems from the belief that the soul comes from the water and returns to it in death. Another use for this water is known as the cake of the mountain. It's quite delicious. <laughs> According to an old woman in the village, there is a saying, when Akami lets out a cry, one must wash in Mikamori. Like it, the mountain just rumbled. Yes. When Mount Akami cries out or rumbles, one ritually immerses oneself or otherwise wets oneself with the water. The custom likely comes from the mountain's sound being a bad omen, they used a pure water as a sort of ward. But the water's contaminated. But when the water dries, your daughters may be gone. Do not go and search when the mountain is awake. This must refer to girls being taken to the mountain after the ward has worn off. An explanation for the number of girls going missing in the area. So use sacred water on the ladies. It's not letting you check surveillance again. I guess I didn't find the info I needed. I keep saying there's like something like here. Ah. Oh. Well, that's a cute little book holder. Local folk anecdotes. The Mikamori region has many anecdotes regarding the act of photographing the dead. Quite simply, don't fucking do it. <laughs> many are simple superstitions, but some allow us a glimpse into the customs of another time. These stories show both great understanding and great fear. Vanishing. A man showed a photograph to a friend. The picture showed the faint silhouette of a person. Upon seeing, a, seeing the silhouette, the man cried out and ran, leaving the photo where it was. Each time the man looked at the photo, the silhouette grew more and more distinct. It was his friend. It is said that his friend disappeared after that. A local fool suddenly declared that he had married. The village threw a celebration, but no one had seen the bride. Someone went to man's house and could hear the sound of woman talking. <laughs> However, looking inside, he saw only the man from behind with no sign of a woman. Days passed, and the man hasn't left his house, so one of the villagers went to check on him. There was no one in the house, only an old photograph left behind. 
In the photo was a bride hiding her face, and the missing man was at her side. The man who saw the photo said the bride appeared to be smiling. But that's impossible, because his friend was ugly as shit. Poor as dirt. I really need to investigate. Continue surveillance. Five nights of friend. Oh, God damn it! Where'd they go? Wait, I don't think anyone was in that room. Were they not? Open the door with a little more fucking urgency. Okay, where was that? Like downstairs entrance? It looked like the entrance room. Which I think is to the right. At least I thought it was. It was. It was coming in through the front door. This is that room that uh, no one's sleeping in at the moment. That's the basement. I don't think we've ever been in there. My heart gets weak. I can't even breathe. It takes all my strength just to breathe. All I can do is breathe and then hope to breathe. I grow breathy and spend all my breath just to live. I am aware of death breath and I see. That sounded like a poem. I'm sorry. <laughs> people whispering. People with broken faces. People are strange when you're a stranger. People with ruined bodies. People stare at me from bloody sockets. People crying endlessly. I'm fucking tired of these people. All I can do is close my eyes, cover my ears, and wait for the moment to pass. They're always watching. They say I don't belong here. It should have gotten better. I should have gotten better. I hate people. Alright, so now we're reasonably sure she hasn't been replaced with a ghost. You've now encountered the dr most uh, dreaded creature in all of fictional gaming. The human mimic. I think this is the other room, isn't it? I believe so. Custom of marrying the dead is seen elsewhere too, but though ghost marriage in Mount Hikami was unique. Rather than being done to mourn the dead, the ghost marriage seems to have been part of a ritual in which shrine maidens were sacrificed. Similar traditions joined the dead with an imaginary spouse depicted in votive pictures. However, on Mount Hikami, it seems living men were brought in to be bound to the maidens. Once on the mountain, the men were not allowed to leave. The ghost marriage brought in outsiders to soothe the soul of the Shrine Maiden and to strengthen the pillar she had become. Unable to leave the mountain, the Shrine Maidens would wait for a man to come and die with them. Interesting. I'd almost say that it's like they learned a lesson from the events of the first game if they were aware of the Himuro Mansion. As, uh... 
the ghost that was supposed to keep back the Hellgate fell in love, and her longing for... I forgot the original guy's name. Dick. Yeah, her longing for Dick is what um, caused her to fail. And in the normal, in, in the canon ending to Fatal Frame 1, Mafuyu staying with her ended up um, fixing the problem. Panty raid. Oh, another Water Eye book. Mahikami's name is thought to mean mountain that climbs higher than the sun. Some posit that it was once written in a way that means mountain of the sun gods, but that is far from certain. What is certain is that many tales about the sunset still persist to this day. People must only climb the mountain as the sun is setting. This likely comes from a local ceremony where those going to the mountain to greet their deaths would go at sunset, when the netherworld was said to be closest to ours. One mustn't look at the mountain at sunset. You must stay inside when the mountain cries. The dark sun was a god of misfortune and calamity. The setting sun over Mount Hikami was said to be an omen of this dark sun, drawing people to their doom. As for the cry, tremors are also often seen as a portrait of, oh, sorry, portent of calamity. On Mount Hikami, it was thought that it was the water rumbling, and it is said that if you could hear it, you were eligible to become a shrine maiden. Act now. Other sources say that locals washed in special water when these tremors happened. Are we going to have to collect water that's washed down the mountain? Mayhaps. Well, we've checked in most rooms, I think. Do you want to go back to the surveillance area? Alright, we know there's at least one ghost here. God, she's in the downstairs area. Do you want to try to move to intercept? Try intercepting her again? Or do you think maybe. Oh! It's time to go. Okay, so we're heading... It's here, isn't it? Yes. Okay, so I gotta go... Out the door. And then left. Like, up here. Mm -hmm. Rin, can you pick up the pace a bit, pal? Your friend probably is in danger. That's better, but... Oh no, I'm running. I think I've seen you before. I forgot he doesn't have stun. One are you again? For you, uh, the friend that killed herself. For you, he right? Yes. Please. I don't think we ever found out what happened to Hisoka. No, not Hisoka. Yeah, not Hisoka. I mean, damn, what was her friend's name? She's not. She's not in range. I know. Uh, you got all messy.
You know, if I was heading up this operation, I would have had us all go... Same room. Maybe not even here. Just go farther away from the mountain. I would take us all back to Ren's place. I'm assuming that's farther from the mountain. And, um... And keep everyone in the same room, of course. I saw the one that fell. Alright. Looks like the one in the hallway will re be uh, closer, so let's deal with that one first. But isn't there someone around the corner? To the left? Up here? No. Turn right. Oh, it's dead end, sorry. Should we check on the other one upstairs? Maybe take a peek at her through the camera, just in case. Alright. That's from my special collection. People who hopefully won't die on my watch. <laughs> Alright, so... This is the surveillance room. Remember, there's three girls. Right. I don't like that I can't really immediately see to the right as I come in. So I just have to keep doing this until it tells me to get up. Because it doesn't look like I can intercept them. Waiting for one to pop up behind me. Oh, shit, why are you up? Let's go check on her. Is that the one I just checked on? I think it was. Which means she's, uh, it's not this way, it's that way. Both lead that way. But we can go both ways to reach them, I believe. Damn it, if one of them wakes up, get them downstairs and put a camera in, the other camera in their hands. You know how to use a camera, right? All right. Of course, we're going to have two girls on opposite ends of the second floor. And then I'm thinking, what if the ghosts are getting more coordinated? And they thought, oh, that'll sh if we make it look like she's awake... He'll go check on them, and that'll leave the one on the lower floor free. Or was that a room that wasn't supposed to have an occupant? Yeah. It was 
is this room? The one that left to go find her friend that was spirited away. She was resting in this room. Once the sunset reaches here, the end won't be far off. After that, the mountain will let out a mighty roar and everything will overflow. It will overflow and everyone will end together. It'll be good. It'll be over. Good talk. It'll be over. I came to see everyone so that we can die properly before the end comes. I think I've gotten all of the info. And it's like, sacred water. I think we're about to start seeing some really bad shit. We should slow down the cameras a little bit. Some movement, second floor hallway. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and there was a ghost in that room. Check up on Mew. Uh, Miyu is Miku's daughter. Yeah, but I mean, like, which which room? It's not that one. Yeah, you're right, though. It's like, I can get them both through this loop. Yeah, this is Miyu. No, this is Riku. Is that not? That's, uh, that's Riku. Not Riku. Was it Riku? Damn it, I forgot her name again. Yuri? Yuri. How could I forget the main character's name? She's like around the corner. Oh, hell no. Shit, he spotted me. Ren. Ren, buddy? No. <laughs> All right. It's camera you're time. Fucking in here. You know, if the ghost had just let you leave... You probably could have got her. Yeah. It looked like it was coming from under the bed. I'd really just... Okay. Make sure you check on her before you leave. Are the ghosts just being busybodies? I mean, if you had the camera obscura, is there really a reason to be scared of ghosts anymore? Yes. Why is the TV on? They're here. <laughs> Bubbles. So, the hostels have followed you home. You called it. We gotta use you for just a second, sweetie. Too soon. Yeah.
Good thing it's not using up any of my ammo, huh? Right. You know, his quad shot with Type 7 might not be a bad idea. What was that? Some sort of ghost? As absent-minded as Ren can be, I wouldn't put it past him for getting their enemy ghosts. <laughs> We're only 24 minutes after midnight. If we gotta hold out till 6 a.m. Okay, so we have some guests. I think we'd better check the front. If it tells me to. I think it's out here and then to the right. I believe so. Guys, uh, business hours are... Uh, not in the now. Morning. Ah. Ah, uh, did that hurt? Good. Good thing I can just phase through them. Okay, I was worried the man was going to leave you alone and try to go after someone else. Hey, Cindy from accounting, you keep him busy, I'll get the girls. I don't know what the hell he's doing, but I don't like it when they do that. I think the other one's dead, because I don't see the indicator on my side. Right. And you're right, I, the four shot is a lot more useful with the seven. Because I'm not, I feel like I'm wasting anything. Okay. Alright. Those two are down. Surveillance. Put on my Freddy mask, charge my flashlight, wind the jukebox, and see if Cheek is doing anything later. <laughs> and what fresh hell awaits us next? Oh, damn. Oh. Damn! No. If, if Rui woke up on her own, she would have said something to you, Ren. She has more sense than that. At least I hope so. I don't think this is time sensitive. I don't think you can, like, lose this because they find her. I think it's just changing your objectives. Oh, Ruby's going in there. Oh, good, she's going there to help, right? Or she's possessed and she's about to choke a bitch out. I'm thinking the latter. This may be the end of the segment. Where am I? Are we in that house? Are we at the end? Yep, we're at the house. You're right. Ooh, close call there. The guy was a dragon. No though. death by snoo snoo, please! <laughs> Did 
Did you want to spend any points to upgrade Hojo's camera? Or you want to save it for Rui? I mean, I'm sorry, not Rui. Um, Yuri. Yuri. So as they need down whilst taking photos using the full continuous photos features. If you're using Type 7 and Snapshot... Huh. Slow burn. He can't. He doesn't have any lenses, though. He seems very... He is a side character. I was about to say, he seems very side characterish, but that's mm -hmm. exactly what he is. Uh... Distance... Yeah, because his doesn't take as much to upload. Because, you know, for the other one, we need 160,000. Mm -hmm. But on his third, it's 120. Uh, we may... Let's just... Let's just I'm saving him. Okay. I've, I've got a pretty good feeling that it's uh, Yuri who's going to have the bigger battles. Damn TV still on. Oh, okay, you want to check it now, that's fine. I can't make out with this television. I mean, I can't make out anything on this television. <laughs> I can make out with that television. The torn side off. There isn't anyone inside. That man was dragged this away! He's probably dragged upstairs. Now, I didn't have time to snapshot. Fair enough. It, I mean, it didn't even give me the option. Yeah, I, I noticed that. No hands. Rui's notes have fallen on the floor. What could this mean? <laughs> These people can afford some really nice notebooks. Yeah. Mr. Hojo is captivated by the woman in that photograph. He's never been good with the men in But he's starting to change. I can't do anything about it. He's changing. Puberty's a hell of a drug. I'd like to keep things between us just as they are. The relationship we have now. I like the ambiguity. But he's going to decide sooner or later. I wonder which way he will choose. Oh, so she isn't sure if they're more than friends or not. Oh. And now that Hojo's finally hitting puberty at 25. <laughs> Rui, I... like having you hired on staff. Close enough. <laughs> I'll fucking take what I can get. Hey, hey buddy. You want some nerd root? <laughs> Where did you go? Ghosts don't just go through the wall. <laughs> I can't tell if that was him saying that or like a deep demonic voice. Because it sounded like. Where's. Oh, you can see the cable car. Where's Where's the tall dummy mommy? Where'd she go? She should be right here. She's not interested in these segments, I guess. Wait, what? Now the door's unlocked? I'm in like the weird other version dream realm of it, and I can, okay, all right. They did call it like the ephemeral house, didn't they? Yes. And it's been common for frequently revisited locations to have their doors change status. Oh, it's actually her this time. Sure. Don't touch her ass! I hope he was going for her arm. What the fuck are you doing asleep at the... No way. She got legs. Look at her. Okay. She now look at the, the look at that area with the camera. He's like, where's Rui? Oh, wait, I was watching television. I'm waiting for his head to move, and then... So something pushed him asleep, and then fucking Bubbles walked in. Psst. Hey, get up. We're going. Oh, oh, he's looking at the recordings, not live. Yeah. Going clubbing. Oh, thank God. Yeah, he's out cold. Let's go. 
Party girls forever! Party girls for life. <gasps> She's still on the clock, goddammit! Oh, they've all... I got knocked out and they're all missing now. We, we don't know if they got Miu yet. Yeah, they did. Come on, they got her. She's getting up on her own. There's gonna be a ghost here in a second and be like, hey, let's go. We're all going clubbing on Suicide Mountain. There's gonna be a rave. We're having a rave on the Suicide Beach. It's girls' night. It's girls' <laughs> night. That means have fresh drinks. Oh, good. I gotcha. They didn't get her. Uh, you, you okay? go back. I think, I think I left my wallet up there. I fucking need my wallet. They, I'm, they're going for realistic, but they still have, like, anime eyes, and that throws me off a little bit. Because, um, Rin looks very normal, but the, the ladies... <laughs> yeah. I could believe Rin, but yeah, you're right. Like, the ladies have, like... Oh! Oh! Miyu's grabbing a camera of her own. I wonder whose camera it is. Oh, the one who went missing. Uh, Yuri. I think she has Yuri's camera. No, you're going together. He's got to go up there anyway. His two besties are missing. Rin is watching over the sleeping Yuri and Miyu on the surveillance cameras, but he passes out because he's a fucking chode. He has a dream where he's chasing after Rui. When he wakes up, both Yuri and Rui are gone. Yuri. He finds Miu getting ready to leave for Mount Akami, taking Yuri's camera obscura with her. The good one! Thank God she took the good camera! <laughs> oh! Oh. The door shuts behind Miu, leaving a bewildered Rin behind. Damn it, Rin, can you do nothing without Rui telling you? He's just standing there he's like, How are these doors shutting by themselves? Hmm. I wonder if I have a book here on that. <laughs> and it's like, Place haunted. Ah. Oh. Fascinating. Another S? Somehow? I think you booked it. And you fought most stuff with Type 7. It, oh, yeah. Whatever, there's a bonus for that. The Witching Hour completed. I wonder, do you get those achievements if you get an S rank on a mission? That's a good question. Did I unlock any costume? Would it even tell me? I have no idea. find somebody to raid yeah we're gonna call it a night tonight folks i am sore exhausted and everything is screaming for mercy uh i should probably kill my food before i eat it that might help um yes, yes it would so we did roughly two hours i mean that, yeah, that's good mm -hmm. we got two segments out of the way um i am i'm liking this i know we're just like streaming the same game like five or six times in a row but actually liking this game. Yes, I would like to see it completed. And when we complete it, I have a suggestion for our next co-stream. Oh? I want to watch you fucking play Alan Wake. I have never seen more than five minutes of that game played. It will be done. I want to sit in on this shit. We'll go in the living room, we'll have the big TV, it'll be fucking phenomenal. 